Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever it is in your local time frame of the world. Welcome to another episode of Minecraft Inferno. Uh, gonna be making some uh, armor progress here today. Um, gonna be working on some new armor for a fight that we're gonna do in the next episode, hopefully. Uh, we're just in here, we've got some, a uh, couple more trees set up on uh, botany, bonsai pots. I keep switching between botany and bonsai pots. Uh, so we got the, the mahogany saplings, willow saplings, and rubberwood saplings. Uh, between streams and episodes, I did did a lot of lava fishing to get the ender pearls to make those. And I have a couple extra stashed in one chest or another here somewhere uh, that I really should find because I'm going to need one of them. Might even have put them upstairs. Uh, da -da 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 no, I didn't put them in here. But I, we're gonna make some more drawers. So where did I put those? No, not in there. Not in there. I know I put them somewhere convenient where I wouldn't forget where they were at, and then I forgot where they are. There they are. Okay. <laughs> Found them. Okay. So, first we need to make a 4x4 four four drawer, which I believe takes two chests. Uh, I'm gonna go make them out of the... Actually, I'm gonna, make, I'm gonna start another row, so we're gonna go crimson. Four chests. Uh, four chests. So make four chests. Then, uh, I'll call this are tucked into bed. They're just relaxing then. Some crimson planks. Oops, one too many. Oh well. So the crimson four, two by two drawer. Put that extra back. Actually, I'm just going to do one for right now. So I'm going to set the other three in here and then probably forget where they're at later. This one out here, set it down. We want two rows, yeah, two blocks between. We'll set it down right there. Now, the sapling I'm going to grow in there, I need to go make. Because for the botany, or botanist, I keep doing botany instead of botany, for the botanist tools, including the botanist pickaxe that we need to uh, do some bee farming with takes ancient wood, which comes from an ancient sapling. Well, I don't have an ancient sapling, and I don't know 100% if it's actually going to work in the bonsai pot in here, but we will find out. I can grab most of this stuff. I can grab uh, sugar cane, sage seeds, crimson fungus, warp fungus. I can grab all that right now, but I'm going to need two dark oak, uh, melon, sage. Sage, sugar cane. Crimson warped fungi. One of them. One of them. Oh, I just need one, not two. Okay. So I need still need a gold leaf. And two hellbark saplings. Hellbark saplings I need to uh, transform dark oak saplings into. So dark oak. Give me two of those. And we'll put them in the hopper up here at the blood altar. Take a couple of dark oak saplings. them in your, your blood altar on instantly. That was a lot quicker than I expected. They become hellbark saplings. So 
So let me set, put this out, get that out of the way. Actually, I can go ahead and plant one of these. And grab a gold leaf. I'm gonna need, let's see. Gonna need the gold powder. Put around here. how that's supposed to go and I think I'm just the, the, the mood of this song I'm not really striking me right now so we'll go to the I'm gonna change songs here real quick okay so we got that down okay so hellbark Sugar cane warped. Hellbark. Sugar cane warped. Then from the bottom, crimson gold leaf sage. Crimson gold leaf. Sage, then torque the tree up. Well, that does its thing. I do want to point out last episode I put down the natural altar here and it popped red. Reading the book a little bit, it says you need to build a whole, uh, an entire crimson altar, which is this whole setup. The gold nether bricks you get as a quest reward. Uh, the nether bricks around red nether bricks here, which actually I was confused as I confused as something else when I was building it. Um, the only thing you don't vitally need are these crimson aura, crimson aura fungus, but the book does say they help replenish the aura that is around here. So as this uses the aura, those fungus will help replenish it. So that strange things don't happen. Now we've got the our uh, ancient saplings. Let's go see. The game wants to cooperate with for me. I'll put one in here. Grab one of the bonsai pots. Grab some dirt. No, not another rack. There we go. Uh, gonna need to make actually gonna need to make an axe and a hopper. So might as well do that while I'm here. Okay. Two of those and three eight of those. It's the axe so the tree will automatically cut down. And the hopper, so it'll pipe into the drawers. And if I ever forget the uh, recipe for making a hopper, just 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 go, just go ahead and bury me, because I'll, I'll be you know I'll be deceased. I will know I will have shuffled off this mortal coil if I ever forget the uh, recipe for a hopper. there, the dirt in it, the iron axe, and the hopper in there, and the ancient sapling. It is growing. Let's make sure it'll actually produce what it needs to produce. Again, it says non-functional in nether. But yep, 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 yep. Got the uh, ancient logs. That's what I'm going to need to make the ancient sticks. So I can go ahead and just shut that off. Had some, uh, just had some obsidian and glass coming out of there. Uh, obsidian for a few other things. Now that that's done, 
I need 18 of these. We're going to go do a quick. Oh, server's doing a backup. Make a couple blocks of pig iron. We're going to go transform them into the infused iron. So we need the infused iron ingots to make the life infused iron that is the uh, ingredient for the botanist armor set. I can see this altar is doing its thing. I never know. I did notice there's a pig face on the. Uh, front of that block there. Let's see, I'm going to need some, uh, while well, that does its thing, I'm going to need some gold powder for the upgrading into the life infused. There we go. that back into ingots need to grab an orb okay orb and life infused iron is four of these and the one of those so four of those and one of those that's going to output to right there. That is done. Okay, so I need to do that three more times. but I have that set to automatically output to the chest below. And there's the last one of those. Okay, we made four of those life-infused irons in order to be able to come over here. We take these off. Should be that plus one of those. That's the botanist chest plate. Now I wonder, will this keep the gold? Nope. Okay. Loot loses the golden. But that's fine. Let's see, helmet has, that's three armor, one. It's just two armor. This has some other, other improvements on it. Let's just see what I look like in the full set here. Um, but we get regeneration one and plus two luck with the full set on. So I say looking pretty good. The, the armor matches my skin tone very well. <laughs> okay. That also gave us a couple of quests for rewards. Uh, yep. Getting the ancient sapling gets me a green heart sapling. Ooh, an earth slime dirt. So I can start growing uh, slime trees, which I'm guessing is probably going to be important and handy. Uh, busy bees. Oh, this was the uh, silky comb that I picked up. Uh, we, we've, we've got it going in a previous episode. Uh, let's see, magical metals. 
Flower pattern. Okay, yeah, botanist armor. Botanist tools. So actually, I want to make the pickaxe. So I just need three of the iron infused ingots. Let me go put a couple of these away. I believe I've got a, uh, I'll just call it a spider egg. I thought I had one of those as a, listed as a surprise box. Yeah, break for surprise. And in the, in the tool tips, when you're paused or loading, it, uh, can be used to remove curses, okay? It calls that, uh, it says the surprise is spiders. I'm gonna put the slime, dirt, and tree in here for right now. I'll get I'll get them set up in a, their own uh, their own bonsai pots later. Right now we do need to make grab these three iron infused ingots. Grab uh, a couple of these logs. We've had that that ancient tree doing its thing with. So we need to make planks. And from the planks make slabs. From two of the slabs make two sticks. Okay. Make the botanist pickaxe. Flower power quest completed. Oh, no rewards for that one. Dang it. Uh, let's see, is there anything else? Actually, yeah, the, the dog. <clears throat> I, could, I think that summoning the dog is the last one here. So let's go give this botanist pickaxe to a digger bee. Botanist pickaxe, give it to a digger bee, becomes an ashy mining bee, which I'll just have flowering for right now. I know, you know what? Ashy mining bee, crystalline. I've got a crystalline bee in there. Let me, let's grab a couple of flowers. Breed and see what kind of bee we get. Burning blossoms are a pain in the butt to get because you have to go downstairs for them. I have yet to find a way to uh, grow them. And I've even tried growing vanilla flowers on grass with bone meal. And they just don't they just don't grow. Might be a biome thing, might not be, I don't know. I think if I remember right, get digger bee in here. So I need to, yeah, give the digger bee that. So, oh, where'd you go, digger bee? There we go. So we got the ashy mining bee, the crystalline bee. Where'd the ashy mining bee go? There we go. Get those two in the mood. And we made a baby bee. As soon as it settles for a second, I can see what it is. Let's settle. <laughs> Iron bee, okay. So we've got an Iron bee now. If I can come up, I want to come up here. Grab a block of iron. Make a block of iron. Not like we've had any shortage of iron, but you never know. Plus, I think I can breed that iron bee with other bees. To do things. There's my there's my pickaxe. that right there so when the baby iron bee that we just made grows up it will uh, 
have a place to grab some pollen and go do its thing. Right now it's stuck in the cobweb. So I will do some more bee breeding and getting some other resource bees going in there between episodes. For right now, that was, where was that? That should have been. Got another busy bees. I think that was just a task. I don't think that was a full quest. Make red bee spawn egg. Redstone comb, archie bee. So that that dinged something. Oh, I just made the uh, the breed an iron bee. It, okay, it was just an advancement. But I need to get the the cones. Yeah, I need to get an iron, copper, and tin comb. Uh, so I just need to get work on tin. But continuing to breed those, the ashy mining and the uh, crystalline bee will get me those particular types of bee. So one more thing to do. Let's grab the summoning altar. Which I know is in here somewhere. Totally organized with my, my organization system here. I know exactly where everything's at, don't I? I should. It is okay and then the altar chickens bees slimes wolf okay three rotten flesh three bones and a vile dust uh, rotten flesh. Thought I had a fair amount of, unless I converted it all to something. Oh, there we go. Three rotten flesh. Uh, do I have any bones? Ooh, that's actually a very good question. Yes. Three rotten flesh, three bones, and the vile dust. Do I have it right there? Okay. Where was that again? There we go. Just three, and then three, and then the vile dust, okay? dust. And I don't know if it's going to come out friendly or not. Which is why I'm putting it in a pen. There you go. Yep, man's best friend. Grab some bones. There we go. Got me a puppy wolf. Okay. I think he's hang out there for right now. Next time I get raided by the Lords of Inferno, I may take him with me. Then again, I may not, because that may be fatal for him. <laughs> But I do have a wolf friend now. And that, I do believe, completely completes this particular chapter. I mean, I can do an apple a day keeps the doctor away. I, did, I didn't eat that to begin with. But, uh... I'll go ahead and stick it in there. I do have golden apple. Let's see, not, not for eating. So it's really hard to meal, not for eating. Yeah. 
So, Dark Forest is complete. So, we got, some, we got the bees over there going in happy. I can come over here to my, my little checklist. I can take out uh, Botanist's armor. I can go ahead and take out the wolf summon. Let's go do a town map. Nice quick and easy thing. Quick and easy achievement. Empty map is just uh, eight paper around a compass. I believe I've got a compass somewhere. Maybe not. I'm doing two different mod packs. So sometimes my, my inventory, uh, what I have in inventory and what I don't, uh, gets jumbled up in my head at times. Compass is just four iron around a redstone. Okay. Even if I have one, they're easy enough to make. Or iron around a redstone. Boop, 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 boop. Compass. Empty map. I do believe if I take this empty map, over to Town Hall. Where we actually had a raid occur earlier today. And I can confirm after multiple times it's happening. Uh, after the Town Hall inventory first to unlock the map, okay? Information, permissions, citizens, settings, work orders. Where's the inventory? Hi, mercenaries. Town map. Permissions. Citizens. Settings. Okay. Oh, there we go. Shift right click. Okay. Town map, drop off a normal scale Minecraft map in the town hall inventory first to unlock the map. Need to be not an empty map, but an actual map, okay. Town map. Okay, because that's as much as I... Because that's as much of the map as I completed. That's all it's going to show. Okay, so give me the map back. Let's see, I need to go north. Why is that map backwards? To go south. The map has me has the, the, the character spinning. Even though I'm not. Okay. I might need to make a couple more of these to cover other checks and chunks and sections. Yeah. So I covered this chunk. I need to basically drop off all these maps to have it complete. I don't know that I like that look though. I'll, I'll stick with the mini map and uh, this map right here for my town map. But we got a town map anyway. Why do I 
I still have this uh, nether rack in my inventory. So be sure and give the video a like, give the channel a subscribe, and ring, ding, ring, clang the bell so you get notifications when these videos go up. Thank you for watching. Drop me a comment down below. Some suggestions for the village. Um, it's maxed out right now, uh, but I, I think something just blew up my purple plants. Did they? Nope. Looks like it's still intact from here. Uh, just some other buildings I can put up in the village. Uh, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna need to upgrade the town hall again to make it even bigger. Um, but I might have a, a unemployed citizen or two. So let me know uh, buildings I can put in the village to uh, keep them busy. Um, I'm going to be working, since I've got access to clay now, I'm going to be working on some blocks for the kitchen here. So let me know what I, what I what design should I put my kitchen in. Should I move my stove closer, closer to the sink? Should I move it further away? Uh, is there any particular kind of cupboards I should look for? Um, you know, stuff like that. Just let me know what you think about the the, the series as a whole. Uh, I'm 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 more of a uh, form versus function person, so I will always take design suggestions. Um, I'm going to get uh, a couple more saplings set up here, uh, including the the new ones that we got. Yeah, including the the slot the green heart and the slime one there so like i said be sure to give the uh video a like give the channel a subscribe and uh let me know just let me know stuff in the comments down below i do record these live at live space that's live.space slash elignore so you can come out and see some of the other stuff i do things i prepare uh, thanks a lot for watching. Thanks a lot for hanging out. I will see you all around another time. Bye-bye now.